Amber from the Vault here, back with more Mass Effect Andromeda. Now we're going to do a couple more of these Nexus side missions. There's a few more that are on our map. First one we're going to start, I'll show you right here. It is going to be Krogan Betrayal. This is the one we're going to start with. The only reason I'm not walking down there right now, guys, is because as soon as that door opens, you start that side mission. You start hearing their conversation. So I wanted to go ahead and give you guys just a quick intro. So as always, remember, guys, if you like this video, please like, comment, subscribe. That means the world to me. That's what keeps me going. I'm going to go ahead and do this, mostly side missions in this video. So if you're not interested in side missions, don't hang out with this one. Go ahead and skip this video. I will see you guys in just a second. Watch your tone. You saw what happened to the Krogan. But we need this equipment. Well, you're not getting it. Stop making frivolous requests. It's not a frivolous request. Properly functioning air filters are at... Frivolous. You'll just have to make do. We can't fix the station breathing bad air. Your incompetence isn't my problem. Just do your job. What okay. do you want? We're going to stick with our normal, logical, professional. I'm not sure why she's looking away, though. Whatever's going on, it's not fair to take it out on me. <sighs> Apologies, you're right. This is not your fault. Huh. That's kind of a weird camera angle, because it looked like she was looking off. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and stick with professional. He was pretty abusive towards you. Is that normal? Yes. He's horrible. Working with him is a total nightmare. Just last week, he tried to redirect some of the supplies we need to keep the stasis pods going. Why? I have no idea. But if Kesh hadn't stepped in and threatened to airlock him, it would have been a disaster. He's always like that. Making bad decisions, driving the Krogan away, treating people like scum when no one's watching. You'd think your boss would have the power to do something. She hates Spender. But there's only one of her, and she can't always be around to deal with him. Things have gotten so bad that Kesh had to literally kick him out of engineering. How literal are we talking here? Boot to ass. Oh, it was glorious. We need him gone, but as incompetent as Spender is at his job, he's insanely good at keeping it. Kesh can tell you more. All right. Let's go find out from Kesh, because that sounds like some wicked bullshit. So we are going to have to go ahead and go to another part of the ship. This is kind of the way side missions here work. I guess it kind of worked that way too when we were on the Citadel. So I'll go ahead and jump there, guys. I'll see you in just a second. Alright, guys. So we're going to go meet with Kesh. Pathfinder, thanks for helping Raj and Zara find Atkins. He's not getting out of lock for a while. Dell told me you saw her arguing with Spender. Hijack's doing his best to throttle my department. How's he getting away with that? Spender doesn't know the first thing about engineering, but he knows how to play people. More importantly, he still talks to the exiles. I'm sure of it. I just can't prove it without your help. Of course we're gonna help. This needs to be investigated. I'm glad someone thinks so. Talk to Canvos. He likely has security footage of some kind of evidence, but you'll have to convince him to authorize release. Okay. Nothing more for now. Good luck out there. Okay. So, of course, we gotta run to a new place. Kandros is right down here, though, if you remember. Oop, he's the Turian in charge of security. Because that's what Turians do. Let's see. Oh, <laughs> wrong one. Sorry about that. Thanks for understanding about the outpost and the protesters. You don't strike me as a political type. I'm not. Just pro keeping everyone alive. Maybe those protesters will eventually understand too. It's done. I don't want to think about it. Need something else? I was told I should talk to you about the mutiny. I wasn't on the Nexus when it happened. I started reading up on it, but you know how things get around here. Do you know where Spender was during that time? Why Spender? Wait, you think he might have had something to do with the mutiny? Maybe. Just trying to sort things out. You know, the logs I did look through showed a few discrepancies. I meant to dig deeper. If you're investigating, how about I give you access to the security vid archives? Thank you. Anything else? 
Bye, Kandros. Duty calls. You and me both, Pathfinder. Okay. Where am I supposed to get those? Over there? Tracking okay. Enemy activity. Command check and verify. I feel like we're always just running around. Huh. This file won't play. Sam, can you boost the quality? Processing. Playback initiated. Wait. Is he handing something over to one of the mutineers? Take this. It'll help you. Don't fail. I am sorry, Pathfinder. This backup file is corrupted. The audio tracks are heavily degraded. Someone may have deleted the original, and this version was restored during a system-wide reset. Hmm. Ah, oh, come on, that's not a coincidence. Sounds like a cover-up to me. I concur. While I cannot restore any more audio, the location appears to be Kadara. How do you figure? In common parlance. Lip reading. I do not recognize the location from any current data. It appears mountainous and populated. We will need to find the planet before I can confirm. I will contact you via my node. Okay. So we need to confront Spender. Let's That's go gonna be Spender. That's gonna be all the way back there. So what I'll do guys is I will go ahead and cut. Wait, is he down he's not down here, is he? Oh, Wait, I think he's actually up here. Well, never mind. I thought we were going to have to go all the way back. I'm so used to this game sending me to hell and back. Looks like we're actually going to go up here. Okay, here we go. The mutiny went as well as you'd expect. So much violence. Then, after nearly destroying the station, the Krogan asked for more power. Good riddance. Ryder, is it? William Spender. Apologies if we met before. I meet a lot of people running Colonial Affairs. Running Colonial Affairs? I thought you were the Assistant Director. That's right. Assistant to Addison. So we know who does all the real work. Let's go ahead and stay professional, logical. There's evidence tying you to some pretty shady things, Spender. I saw the footage. You were handing something off. What footage? From Gavorkum? Routine business meeting. Whoever you're talking to clearly has an axe to grind. And frankly, a Pathfinder shouldn't be wasting time on a witch hunt. You'd be wise to let this be. Ooh, he threatened us. Alright guys, looks like we're going to find that planet. Obviously we're not going to do that right this second. Let's go ahead and find I know there's a couple more side missions to do, so let's go ahead and find those. Alright guys, here we're here for a mission called the Firefighters. But as I was coming, I saw that we have a... Uh, we have something here. Somebody wants our attention. Damned exiles. Let's go ahead and check with him. Oi, Pathfinder. Today has not been a good day. Why's that? A large shipment of medical supplies intended for Prodromus was intercepted by those damned exiles. Scouts confirmed they divvied the supplies up among their own outposts. Okay. As always, I'll see what I can do about reclaiming them. That would be great. Thanks. Maybe when you assholes, you can rectify all this. All right. So an exile raid. So that's actually not what we're doing now, of course. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, I thought for a second that it uh automatically put that one up. Actually, it looks like. Hold on, guys. I think there's more in here for us to do. Are you sure you want to do this, Nilkin? I am. It's for the best. What's for the best? I'm putting Nilkin here back into stasis. The conviction was overturned, but everyone still treats me like a murderer. When Mariette heard the truth, she left me. I just want to go to sleep and wake up when things are blown over. Ah, oh, this is a hard one. Makes sense. Good luck. Huh. All right, guys. So I was on my way out of here, but it looks like there's actually uh, we can talk to Doctor Carlisle here. Harry, what's happening with Scott? Well, we got him out of the pod. I don't want to get your hopes up, but Sam managed to uh, find him. You might say. I don't follow. Well, he's still in a coma, but he also has an implant like yours, and Sam managed to access it. 
He's made contact. I wouldn't think that's even possible. You and me both, but Sam, well, I guess supercomputers have a different view of things. They're in a coma. Scott's mental processes remain intact. So is he okay? You can ask him yourself. A moment while I establish a link with his implant. Proceed. Scott? Can you hear me? Is that you, sis? I don't understand. What's happening? There was a problem with your stasis pod. You're in a coma on the Hyperion. Do you understand? Wow, really? How are we talking? Sam linked into your implant, but they say you're stable. You're safe and sound in the med bay. Guess I'll take your word for it. I can't feel anything, but I still hear you. Is that okay? Oh, damn. Oh, what do we tell him? I mean, it's gonna be hard to hear that his dad's dead, but I don't know. I'm guessing he probably didn't have a relationship with them anyway. Let's not lie to him. I don't care if he's in a coma. Maybe I'll wake up sooner. I'm not sure how to say this, but... He's dead, Scott. What? There was... an accident. What do you... Accident? How? I mean, Dad... I know. It was all very sudden. Nothing anyone could do. I don't believe it. I'm sure he'd want to be here now. Did we at least find home? Dad kept talking about how amazing it would be. See, I don't feel like we should lie to him. There's been some... complications. The Golden Worlds didn't exactly deliver. I don't understand. I thought... Scott? This is... This is all wrong. This... is a nightmare. Scott, it's okay. I, I didn't mean to. His pulse rate is increasing rapidly. I don't feel well. Ah, great. That's enough for now. He needs to rest. Scott. Well, I almost killed my only remaining family. <laughs> You know, shit happens. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and head back, guys. I want to do that uh, that other mission. So I'll see you guys in a second. All right, guys, here we are in the tech lab. We're gonna go ahead and meet with Dr. Ardriana. Is that how you say your name? I'm certain, Professor. Aridana. Okay, let's go see what she needs. Hello, Pathfinder. A moment. What can I do for you, Doctor? I have a math problem. Some vital equations that only a mind like Sam's could solve. They concern strange transmission patterns in the Scourge. Perhaps random noise, perhaps not. That could be a ship, or even turbulence in the Scourge we should know about. Given the complexity and the security implications, I recommend transferring the equations directly into SAM node. I have them on an optical storage disk for you. I'll see if I have time. Thank you, Pathfinder. Please thank SAM as well. All right. So it looks like there's one more... Yeah, this guy. Let's go talk to Professor Herrick. Oh, he just he keeps running away from us. What is that all about? Ah, Pathfinder. The information you gathered is marvelous. You and your Sam, of course. Thanks, Mr. Professor Herrick. My Herrick. colleagues and I work directly with Sam, refining your field scans into discoveries to benefit the initiative. Hopefully. What fields do you study? Herrick's in the life sciences. I do planetary geology, oceanography, rocks and runoff. Our Adana's the space and math ways. The sterling data you've sent has us running ragged. Addison finally gave us an actual workspace. Keep up the good work, champ. Alright. So it's just part of getting to know the Nexus. Let's go ahead and keep going. So at this point what we need to do is we need to go put this into uh Sam notes. What I'll do is I'll go ahead and meet you guys back in just a second and I'll jump. So see you in a sec. Alright guys, here we are in Sam node. Remember, we're doing the firefighters. Let's go ahead and see what happens. Welcome back, Ryder. 
Dr. Aradana at the tech lab sent some equations for you to solve. I'm ready. Transferring them now. Have fun. Hey, what the? Sam? Delicious code detected. Please stand by. Sam? Detected Help, Sam. Command. Delicious code. Please stand by. Is there anything I can do? Sam? Is that another malfunction or. Sam? You trying to show me something? The hell? Okay, I think I got it. Okay. Sam, talk to me. Hello, Pathfinder. Please initialize the console to restore normal operations. Okay. Sam, what happened? The equations contained a Trojan horse program, a virus, specifically targeted to sever our connection and render me helpless. Reconnecting would be impossible. You'd need a crack AI programmer to create a virus like that. Yes. Only my unique adaptions prevented permanent damage. Unlock the door. Let's head to the tech lab and see what Dr. Aradana has to say. Ah, great. Alright. So we'll be off uh, meet you back there, guys. What the hell? Alright, guys. So we're back at the docking area. Let's go ahead and confront the doctor. Find out why she's trying to kill Sam. See, I didn't get the feeling that, that she was nefarious or anything. Usually Asari's... These types of Asari's aren't evil. We know it Maybe they're changing it up on us. Stop reach. running away from me! So what is its name? Welcome, Pathfinder. Did Sam solve the equations I sent? Solve them? They almost brought down Sam Node. The equations contained a virus designed to target artificial intelligence. You think I... Never! I abhor violence against any life, organic or synthetic. I believe that. Then how did the virus find its way into your equations? Perhaps my files were altered or replaced. But why? Hmm. I've seen a lot of down with AI sentiment lately. Graffiti. Complaints to ten. Perhaps someone took the next step. Why would anyone hate artificial intelligence? Synthetic life has different needs and motivations. It can be mysterious and powerful. Many fear what is not understood. I get that. I'm gonna go ahead and go with fear. Everything's uncertain. Maybe they just want to feel safer. Attacking Sam is bold, though. I wonder if there have been similar incidents. The AI kiosk was busted this morning. I can look around. Okay, let's see. Pathfinder Ryder, if you oh. will. Hold on. We can talk to him, Hi, too. Pathfinder. Want to hit some rocks for science? Sure. Absolutely. What do you need? Sam and I used your scans and made a VI for geophysics surveys. Beta builds on the console there. Test it out in the field, and I'll wrangle you a consultant's bonus from Director Addison. How's that sound? Okay. So I'm assuming the terminal's back here. There we go. Okay, so looks like this interfaces with our Omni tool. Alright. Let's go figure out where this AI is and what the heck's going on with it. I'm really impatient, guys. Oh, look! They fucked with Avena! Detecting Pathfinder Rider. Hi there. Hey, excuse the educational stuff. I hacked Avena as a sock puppet. So, our virus set you free. Hope you're doing better without that AI jammed into your head. Okay. Who am I talking to right now? A friend. Our movement sent the virus to save you. Pathfinder, it's possible they don't realize their virus failed. Pretending that it worked might win their trust. Hello? Okay. Ryder? Okay, well, if we're gonna do that, then we should probably go with casual. Yes. Uh, I can't believe I'm free. Thank you. This is what our movement is for. Helping people like you. Knight says human AI merging is a threat to all life. She'd know, trust me. Oh, Knight's our founder. The virus wouldn't exist without her. Uh, I feel like we should do meter. That would make sense to me. I should thank Knight in person. I'll ask her. She might even give you a tour of our sanctuary. Great, thanks. Can't promise anything, but watch your email. Bye. Alright, so we're on hold, I'm assuming, until we get an email. 
A whole movement of AI-hating hackers with a leader called Knight. She and her followers seem to have experience with human-AI partnership. If they attacked you, they're capable of anything. I'll check my email. We need to find them. Okay, so it looks like that's on hold. Hello. Oh, another one! Damn it! This is supposed to be the chemistry lab. My chemistry lab. You all keep crawling out of the woodwork like space cockroaches. You say that, Dutch, but here you are, pouring people drinks. Uh, hi. I'm standing right here. They're guinea pigs, damn it. Chemists should have guinea pigs. Not have their labs taken over by people giving them things and... and being nice. Oh, jeez. You know, I kind of want to go, uh... I'm gonna go casual on this one. Bad people giving you free things and helping you set up. So inconsiderate. Right? They keep bringing things. Tables and chairs and this bar and lights. Wait, you're making fun of me, aren't you? Don't let Dutch put you off. He's a sweetie, really. I'm not. And the drinks are good. Damn right they are. Uh, I mean... <sighs> Yeah. I'm a dirty squirrel. Ah. Uh, that doesn't sound very good. Okay. I didn't actually want to talk to him. I was trying to come Looking in and talk though. to her. I was going to see if maybe she had some more. Welcome to the vortex. Side missions for us. Oh, here's Liam. Things are shaping up, Pathfinder. Resources flowing in. Sleep is ready to head out. It's starting to feel like the initiative. Not quite up to the sales pitch, but getting there. Feels good, right? Let's let's stick with the idea of hope. See, so I feel like we gotta give our people hope. I feel it, Liam. Finally getting our start. There we go. Getting our shit together. Showing the new galaxy that we have it sorted. If I keep saying it, it's true, right? Sure, buddy. <laughs> Alright, guys, I was actually coming in here just to see if there was another another side mission we could do since that still shows up in my journal. In fact, let me show you guys what the journal looks like. I don't think I've actually shown you guys. So if you go inside of your journal, you can kind of click your tasks on and off here, and it's still listed as an addis additional task. So I wanted to go ahead and see if I could do anything else for him, but it looks like we're finished. So I'm going to go ahead and find something else that's here on the Nexus, and I'll see you guys in just a second. Alright guys, it looks like in order to continue on with any of the side missions that we have currently, we need to head back to EO. 